How to draw a fraction using number lines. Using that grid paper again, we can draw a straight line across, and we're going to start by labeling one endpoint zero and the other endpoint one. Then we're going to partition the line into four equal sections because we want to represent fourths. So you can do four spaces on the grid paper or you can just have four equal spaces. So for this line, every two squares equals one fourth. Once you create your fourths, have your students label everything or just label it to the point to represent the fraction. So starting at zero, we're going to jump from zero to the first tick mark, that's one fourth. And from one fourth or from that first tick mark to the second tick mark is two fourths. And then again, make sure students can show you where two fourths is on that number line. Next, we'll represent five twelfths. So again, start with a line, create your endpoints, zero on the left, one on the right, and then partition or make a tick mark right down the middle. And then we're going to partition each half into thirds. That will create six. So three on one side, three on the other, there's six equal parts. Now we're going to partition each six in half to create twelfths. And now we need to identify where five twelfths is. So we're gonna start at zero and then draw an arrow to represent a jump. Each jump is one twelfth, so we wanna go all the way to five twelfths and then label that. 